Good morning, good afternoon, good evening guys, wherever you are on this beautiful world, whenever you're watching this YouTube video, welcome to the Bitcoin Family YouTube channel of today, a short TA update with like seven, seven amazing charts. Watch them all till the end, it's an amazing video. Let's quickly jump into the first one. Bang. This is like you use the four hour chart, um, the bam bam indicator called a long flag over here. Then we need to wait for a candle to close above the yellow stepping line, that candle closed. We need to wait for the BAM to cross the white line and we need to wait for that green dot and the green hills. There was still some blue C on the bottom, so it's not like a very, very, very confident trade, but it would be a longer take because there is a lot of other confirmations, like for example, the green line on top. So that long, if you would have taken that one like a little bit late over there, um, you would now be in a 2.2% profit without leverage, will leverage a little bit more. Um, of course, I think the target should be the top of this, uh, which is 39,889. That is the moment that I uh, expect a withdrawal, uh, back and again, uh, a retest to uh, lower levels. If we zoom out a little bit, we of course see that we are still in a bearish move. Um, the EMA ribbon flipped over there from um, the, red the, the red line on the bottom to the red line on the top. Um, this nail will take some time before it flips again bullish. So the yellow line on top, and that is the moment that we can um, think about higher levels in Bitcoin again. So yes, a good bullish start, but uh, way not there yet. If we zoom out, we see the weekly. Um, on the weekly, I'm just keeping my eye also on the Bam Bam indicator. Why? Because I told you guys it was a long flag. Uh, we had a red candle dot after that. We, the green area is starting the cloud. This candle has again a longer wick to the bottom, a small body. So maybe we can close a little bit uh, higher in four days. Um, and this could be that reversal moment that we saw over here to the left. And if this is the reversal moment, then again, the bam bam indicator was completely right when it comes to buying and selling uh, on the weekly chart. So you bought over here, you sold over there, you bought over here, you sold over there, and you should be buying over here to sell again somewhere over there. Now, if you want to use all of that, go to the bitcoinfamily.com, this website. You will find all the information about all our indicators, the products. You will find uh, indicator packages, uh, the classic. You can find also the GTGAR, of which I will tell you some more later. And if you want to trade on great, excha great, great exchanges that give you some nice bonuses, then use the Bybit link over here for $4,100 bonus plus 30% discount on the fees of trading and access to the launchpad. Okay, X, amazing dollar, $5,000 bonus up to $5,000. Grab your bonuses down below. It's free money to trade, guys. Now, next chart, this one. The Gaussian channel, um, like I said, we did touch the bottom and we are going up. This candle needs to close higher in one day and 14 hours. This five day candle is going to close and we will open a new five day candle that we will hopefully see uh, touching that green line at 46K. That's what I love to see. But, you know, Bitcoin can uh, move with 10K in a week. We have seen this before. So let's see if Bitcoin can do it again or that we stay at this bottom and even break that bottom and then if we break it, we will get this red area, which is bearish, bearish, bearish. Now, do we have anything else? Yes. If you are part of our Bitcoin family, then you know that we have a free indicator. That is this one, the G G T G A R um, G T G A R, whatever you want to call it. Uh, this one is available if you just walk through the steps on our website. You get free access to this indicator. Um, you only need to take five steps. As you can see, this indicator also tells you when to trade. When a red follows up a green candle like that, a green arrow like that, you see a huge move. Look, here again, you see a huge move. Also the other way around, down, you see a huge move. So yes, very beautiful indicator that you can get access to for free. Um, uh, you can use it on many time frames, on, uh, on the f one day time frame, on the four hour time frame and all those time frames look on the day time frame it gave you a red signal over there and now it's giving you a green signal over there 
So free access, go to this website, products, GTGAR, and then walk through these five steps. Now, quickly jump into some very interesting information I saw today, and it is then this. This is the first chart, and this chart is by Glassnode, guys. The first thing that I see on this chart, okay, week eight, we had a high of 44K, we had a low of 38K, 144. Now, we are moving in this bandwidth already for some time, like here, you can see. So there will be a moment that we break down to the downside or that we go up again. If we look at all the other fundamentals of Bitcoin, like for example, oh, I need to keep moving my face now, um, the number of active entities, um, then we see that it's only going up. Look, this red area, it's only going up. So we are currently at the bottom of that range. We should be going to the top again of that range. So this is like a bull market growth and because we have more users in each rally. So we can see here, there's every time in each rally we have more users. And yes, we drop down in these users, of course, when Bitcoin crashes, because everybody stops trading, but then again, it picks up. And we are still picking up. And that is really cool to see every day um, more users, even when Bitcoin now is down a little bit, we are starting to um, become more active again. Very cool information. Also this one over here. Um, face, bam, oh my God, this is going to be boring. Now, uh, non-zero addresses count in a 30-day change. You can see how many addresses were like neutral over the last 30 days. You can see that here. Um, but you can also see in the other way, in the bull market growth, um, how much it increased you know you can see the green green lines going up that's how much uh, the non-zero addresses increased so more addresses had bitcoins and these bearish sideways movements it goes down so we are now waiting for a reversal we can see a small reversal that needs to go up again with green uh, arrows really cool chart as well I'm going quickly through these charts. If you want to stop them and analyze them themselves, then just pause the video and, and take a look even closer. Now, why would I want to uh, go to this chart? Because this is the percentage of entities in profit. So on this chart, you can see how many percentage of all the entities in Bitcoin have profit. So this is the orange line over there. So at the moment, we are here at this level, which means, uh, let's see, a little bit like this, it's a little bit less than 70% is in profit. So that's like, let's say 65.8% is over here. Um, this is 67.7% when the price is 46K. So at the moment, a little bit less, like I said, than 70% is in profit. So that's only 30% that is in loss. The higher the price goes, the less people are in loss and the more people are in profit. So that's, of course, positive for the market. Let's see. I can see this uptrend again here, a little bit going up. So for me, this needs to go up way back again to like these areas of 95 to 100 percent of people being in profit, because when that happens, the positivity to the mark will change again and people will again have this fear of missing out. And again, like, whoa, maybe 100K is possible and then they will start to buy again. And that's when people will be in profit again more often um, as they are now. So it's about 10.9 percent of the entities. Uh, that is in between of this price range that bought in between of this price range. Really informa uh, informative chart? Yeah, <laughs> informative chart. And then this chart, guys. Let's see this chart. Oh, let's see where my face is. It's okay over here, I think. Yes, really beautiful. Um, the short and long term hodler realized levels. So the short term cost basis, basis at higher than fair value. That is what you see in these. Um, pinkish area areas as you see and you have the short-term cost basis approaches realized price so this is the these are the blue areas so the short-term holland realized price at the moment is 47.2k 
and the liveness price is 38.6 and the realized price at 24.1 so these three lines the blue the green and the orange one you have can see if you look back to the left have been the support lines um, for the Bitcoin price. Here we came to the orange line, here we came to the orange line, here we came to the orange line. The orange line at the moment is of 24,000. The green line at the moment is 38. That's where we are exactly at the moment. So for me, of course, I hope that we will go above that blue line again. But there, of course, is always a chance that after a certain period above these lines, we will touch that um, yellow line. That's why people are calling 24K. I still don't see this happening. I don't see us going below 30K at the moment, but there is always a chance. That's why I'm sharing this chart. Now, then we have one more chart. Bam, that is this one. Uh, this one is a short term other NUPL. Um, what do you see here? You can see that red is capitulation, orange is hope, fear, yellow is optimism, um, belief, and then we have euphoria. That's what happens after the top in 2018. There's capitulation and everybody, that's the bear market. And here again, after the 14K uh, 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 run, you know, we were very optimistic, optimistic here over here, and then bam, we capitulated and we are in the short term bear market. Then we became orange again, and orange is the, is the hope period and from hope we went to optimism again and that was when we created these highs yes again back to capitulation and yes again that same thing and now again back into capitulation what we need now is again that hope that will go into optimism and maybe even in belief and euphoria and that will create this new all-time high so really cool chart really cool information and um, i hope you really enjoyed all of these bam charts and um, if you did enjoy the charts and the video give the video a thumbs up share with your friends and family subscribe to your channel hit the notification bell and leave a comment down below did you enjoy all these charts and if you don't just want to analyze them again yourself then pause the videos on those moments and check them all thanks for watching and see you tomorrow again 